You guys upgraded? Nothing new in terms of those encounters. This guy, as soon as we find that sight sealer. Jerk. Get rid of the sight sealer. Oh. Okay. 
Regrets, huh? I've been an alchemist all my life, so I can't think of a thing. Perhaps one regret I have is I haven't proven the weapons I craft are the strongest. How would you prove that anyway? Let me think. Show me a weapon with an attack of 200 or more. Then I'll know mine were the strongest so I can move on. I have something like that. Not even close. Got two that we gotta really buff up the weapons for. Okay. First time I've been able to get that off since I, st <laughs> I started this, uh, this session. that enemy that was in the middle with them.
世界を変えるか違いがないか探してみましょう That's interesting. Why'd these ones survive that? So much health. I'm pretty sure the precept for this area is just that. Pretty sure the precept for this area is just that they take more damage if they have a debuff on them, but that shouldn't mean they take less damage if they don't have a debuff on them. Hello. It's me. Huh? 
世界渡りするぞ変化を見逃さないことね変化を見逃さないことね。I know this, uh, <laughs> this Aisha gameplay is not particularly gripping to watch, but like her skill set, like I can't use her like Zav where I was just going like skill into skill into skill into skill constantly just cause like her stuff and there's too, there's just, there's too much wind up and she doesn't have like she doesn't have the in kit stuff that makes it that she can, you know, that she can use her skills, like, without getting staggered. Although the way I've been using her, like it, I should make it a point to use Infernal Rites more often. It would definitely speed things up. Like a boss arena. And in fairness, if I had switched to Lusica, I would be playing very similarly to this. Since the way I use Lusica is pretty much like I put up the barrier and then I just start beating the crap out of everything. Just because it, like, it's more of effect it's more effective than using her skills consecutively. Who are you? Oi. 
are you the ones who kidnapped and murdered that little girl? It's him! The Night Devil! The Night Devil, eh? What do you want? I asked if you're the ones who murdered that girl. So what if we did? Then die. Murder time. It's murder, murder time. Oh, so we actually get to use his Night Devil skill set. So, how is he doing this? I don't understand. Because from what they showed, like he... He was raised by, like, basically bandits. I mean, are they saying that, like, the bandits taught him magic? I'm not understanding. Spare me, please. She tried to run and I I went to grab her, but I was too rough. Next thing I knew she was dead. It was an accident, I swear. I even prayed for her and everything so she'd pass in peace. None of this would have happened if we told her stepmother to go stuff it. Her stepmother. That old hag's the one who had us kidnap her daughter in the first place. Yeah, yeah, if anyone's the victim here, it's us. You understand, right? Stab you. I'm gonna stab you. Die. You don't deserve to live. You did not. Looks like you remembered. I hate them. The ones that separated me from my dad. I just wanted to be with him. Now I understand why you're lost. It was your hatred for everyone who came between you and your father. But I'll take care of it. Dad? Oi. Your daughter wants to see you. What do you choose? I'd be happy to send you to her if you want to see her, too. But if not, I will kill you. What are you saying? Answer the question. Of course I want to see her. That's the whole reason we pray, isn't it? We can meet again in the next life. Very well. Don't let her out of your sight this time. Death is too good for you. Never go near that girl again. Treachery, spite, malice, how quickly they can overwhelm a person's heart. Again and again I strike at them. Again and again I kill. I thought I made my peace when I chose this path. But I grow more weary with every step. I mean, they gave us no context for his journey from the moment he joined with the bandit group to this point. I mean, like, like, what made him the Night Devil? Like, he didn't give anything 
be like, yeah, this is this is the moment that it happened. I mean, like, because all they did was like, oh yeah, like this kid betrayed him and he was gonna kill him. Yeah, I mean that's a fucked up situation, but I mean, that's not gonna make you decide. You know what? I'm just gonna I'm gonna start killing like a lot, like a lot, a lot. I'm just gonna go find people. And I'm just gonna kill them all. Really, I mean, I just. I don't have a reason not to kill people, which is a good enough reason for me to kill people. You know how it is, right? Like, you know, I don't see that where that transition happened. And also, once again, like, you know, he's magic. He's magic now. And there's no reason for why he's magic now. <laughs> I chose to kill people, and that gave me magic. Murder is my power, you know? <laughs> you look worse for wear. Leave me be. <laughs> Don't snap at me. I've only come to offer what advice I can to my former pupil. You need to be careful. You know the blood guard has its eye on you. Ever think about lying low for a while? That won't change anything. So be it. Just watch your back. Hmm. Who said that? That isn't either of their voices. He must be killed. None. Off to look for another dead person. Not dead. Lost. <laughs> What is it? They're calling you around here now? The executioner? I hate that name. <laughs> you, you're avenging the dead. But to everyone else, you're just another murderer. Like us. Don't forget that. <laughs> now, now, don't be jealous. And the hair looks dark and Zav's hair was blonde. I think this is Zav. Oh my god. Was that your voice I heard? Why haven't you moved on yet? Hi. My name is Roma. I bear no ill will. I only wish to stop him. Soka. Stop who? Soreva. My best friend. He'll destroy everything if we don't do something. He may even kill the Sovereign. Tell me his name. Zodian of the Bloodguard. He never had any qualms voicing his doubts about reincarnation. Then one day he joined the Bloodguard. I assumed that meant he'd outgrown these ignorant opinions. But I was wrong. Joining the Bloodguard was only part of his plot to kill the Sovereign and start a revolution. He murdered me when I discovered his plot and tried to stop him. If he wouldn't listen to me, he won't listen to anyone. There's only one way to stop him now. Please. You must kill him. This is another, like, upsetting thing here. I mean, so this is proving that the Blood Guard for the most part, are actually dedicated to the protection of the Sovereign. 
So why in the world would they allow the Sovereign to be executed? I mean, like, no matter what it was that what's her name said, like, you know, like, like they knew that they needed to protect the sovereign. Like, even if they were like, okay, you know, we're going to have to put you on house arrest and make you like, you know, like, like you are no longer the sovereign, but you do still need to fulfill your duty as the bloodline heir. So even though you were not ruling, we're going to institute some kind of you know, uh, some kind of republic where we have people representing the various districts or whatever until, you know, your heir comes of age and can become the, can become the next sovereign. Like, you know, like, I, like they obviously would have done something like that if they actually care who the sovereign is. Yeah, that's upsetting. And once again, like I complain a lot, but I, <laughs> I only complain when it's a game that I enjoy. If I didn't like this game, I wouldn't be playing it. <laughs> yeah, like I'm, I'm nitpicking at the story and the narrative because that's the, like the largest thing, like the largest complaint I have on this game is the narrative because, and there's like, and honestly, and this is more of a an indictment of JRPGs in general. I don't know why it is that it's so common for this kind of thing to be in JRPGs. Like I've completed so many over the years and so many of them have these kind of like really obvious, like, you know, we didn't think through these, you know, these story segments. You know, we didn't make sure that they fit in with the world that we're creating. You know, they didn't bother. Actually, like, you know, they have... It's like the person who creates the lore in JRPGs and the person who creates the story in JRPGs are not the same person. That's how it always feels with these games. Like, you know, like, like the person who created the lore, like, you know, when the person making the story needed to, like, do something that loops into the world itself, like, you know, they would ask for some notes or something, but for the most part didn't bother actually knowing anything about the world they're writing the story for. Then you always have like the you know these scenes like this where like you know like they're saying things that completely go against everything that we already know. You know, or make it that other things that we've already seen don't matter anymore. It's upsetting. We must kill him. I'll be waiting for him the next life. Very well. Right here. Okay, so now we have a new path down this way. Oh, 
世界を変えるか違いがないか探してみましょう俺に続けはっはっはっはっ,はっ,はっここは引く潔く行け Stop having me fight flowers.
世界を変えるか変化を見逃さないことね Oh, wow. I did not expect that. <laughs> I did not expect to have accrued that many sword stones in, since we started. <laughs> this has worked out. <laughs> A ghost. I had the finest armor money could buy, but the fallen stole it and killed me. Now I've finally seen the light. It is weapons that are key. Before crossing, I want to see a really potent weapon. Something with an attack of 150 or more. Help me find one. What is up with these quests, man? Oh, find me something with 100 attack on it. Find me something with 150 attack on it. Find me something with 200 attack on it. Why? Why these? These are so lame. Why do I keep on pressing that? Uh, something just occurred to me. Yeah. I have an awakened chance thing on here. We have not had a single awakening. <laughs> I get like we're not using our skills as much as with that, but like we've been using them often enough that I should have seen something. <laughs>
Wow. Okay. That's why I don't use that one very often. But if you only hit one enemy and it's not a big enemy, then it was a waste of time. Like this right here, this should be where that that mission we just did as the Night Devil, like the one where we killed that group of kidnappers, this is where that should have been. And the one where we went and took on the kidnappers, that should have been some kind of like other training thing that they did for Soju when he was still a kid. Because it doesn't make sense to, for, for him to have just been the Night Devil, like, immediately. I mean, obviously it wasn't immediate, like, you know, like years had passed. But it's like, okay, so what happened in those years? Like, why is it that, you know, this kid... Yeah, like, because, you know, because that guy even said that, like, you know, like, that it had been, like, years since he actually saw him. So like I mean like did they I mean did they train him? Like you know, what like he joined them and they were just like alright, uh here's a mission, go do the mission, and when you're done with that mission figure it out. <laughs> <Like what? laughs> like why is it that he didn't see them for years? Yeah. 
Oh, that's a new one. Big bomber. Big bomber. Increase attack while manifested, makes affinity fall more slowly. Right, with and without horn. <laughs> You're the night devil, aren't you? Why are you here? It seems we're the same, you and I. Neither of us want to protect the Sovereign. What do you know? Yeah. No reason to tell that to a dead man. I'm not dying here. The realm needs to change, and I'm the one who's going to change it. Why kill me? Who put you up to this? You can ask him yourself when you go beyond. Beyond the veil? Ah, oh, so it was Roma. Hmm. I should have known. He doesn't hate you. He only wanted you stopped. And you weren't about to stop on your own. No, I wasn't. I can't stand the way people take this life for granted, putting all their hopes in the next. And I'm not the only one. Nothing can stop the revolution now. It's time. Time for this realm to change. And change it will. So... What's the point, do you think? Of life, I mean.
Who's there? What are you doing? Yep. Who's that? You, you're the night devil. Did you kill this man? Why shed all this blood? You don't need to know. You. Wait. It can't be him, can it? Commander! There's been an uprising in Zaka. A mob is advancing on the palace as we speak. And maybe it isn't Zav. Because Zav's supposed to die in the town where he was sent. This battle may be won, but the war for this realm's soul is on the horizon. When it comes, I wonder which side we'll be on. Oi. Don't waste your time on that one. He's stubborn. He won't stray from his path. Guys like him are tough, same as you. Maybe not. Maybe you're, the, you're, maybe you're only doing this to fool yourself into thinking you don't have any doubts. Don't be absurd. Please, I'm ready to go. Hearing voices again. No rest for the wicked. You called? I was wondering if... If you would kill me. You look pretty dead already. Not completely. I'm still half alive. I know it might be difficult to understand, but... Yeah. Not for me. I've seen this before. Okay. Then you'll help me? I don't want to burden my son anymore. It'll be easier for him if I just pass. He'll be free to live his life without me tying him down. Are you sure? Hi. He said he wanted me to be somewhere where the air was fresh and the water clear. So he took me to Kiro Marsh. What? Okay, that's where that house is. The house in Kiro Marsh. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say, why the hell would he do that? <laughs> yes, that's why we found that house there. Because he built a house there so they could live. And she could have a nice view. I know it's a bother to make you travel such a distance. No bother at all. I already did clear that up. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Let's check on the alchemist over here. See if he's got anything new for us. I mean, he's going to have something new, but he's going to have something good for us. That is the better question. Hey. Oh, no, it's another. You jerk. You haven't seen this one before. Minstrel. When fired, this far shot emits a beautiful resonance that befuddles the senses. Increases chance of debuffing the enemy. Oni Doji. Bean. I 
guess we should update the thing. Not worth it to go for the Marine Penmi, though. We'll get this Minstrel, even though we use it. Although, I guess I could set that up to be her farming weapon. So she can actually use her skills. That we get drops. Okay. Makes sense now. I've been a fool. <laughs> the stuff you give them determines what the thing's going to be. So you have to consider what you want out of doing that. So if you were, if I was to have gone for this instead, then it would have been like a refinement or a, uh, a shade stone drop, something like that. But if I do a weapon, then whatever I give them for for the weapon is going to determine what the update is we're going to get. So next time I need to remember to hand over one of each to see what happens. So we've already cleared through all of already cleared through all of next area. Go straight to where we need to be. Point in this boss battle here. Maybe not. Thank you. Now my son can be free. There's going to be a boss battle against your son. No? Okay. I brought some fat from there. I brought some fresh picked fruit. You won't believe how good it smells. Oh. What the? Who are you? Huh? Hey! Koso. Mom? Mom, wake up! Okay, so this is going to be the Zav boss battle. So I was saying that he killed Zav here, not in the town where he was supposed to have killed him. Wait. Lord Soju. It is you, isn't it? Why are you doing this? 
It's none of your business. I disagree. I'm the one who let you live after all. Then what's your plan? To stop you. No one wants a murderous member of progeny's blood on the loose. Is this you covering your tracks then? Make up your mind. One minute you're letting me live, the next you want to kill me. I don't deny it. Do you really think you stand the chance? I'd wager my life on it. Wager you're going to lose. But this isn't where he kills Zav, though. I mean, can't they just keep it consistent? I'm intentionally making it close because Zav's our boy and I won't have him go out like a bitch. <laughs> Enough. Strike true, you coward, if you mean to kill me. Yeah. What about you? You are holding back, hesitant even. I never hesitate. Maybe we should work together to right these wrongs, Lord Soju. Do not call me by that name. I'm sure Lady Sarah would be overjoyed to know you're still alive. <laughs> the Sovereign? <laughs> She's no different from the ones who killed me. You've misunderstood. Lady Sarah never knew of that. To this day, she thinks you set out to see the world and lost your life in an accident. If you bear a grudge, bear it against me and my fellow liegemen, not Lady Sarah. Are you saying I ought to change my ways? Do you know how long I've spent in the shadows of this realm? And you dare tell me now, after all this time, to change my ways? It's our fault. All of it. Please, don't hold it against Lady Sarah or the realm. You don't get to tell me what to do with my hatred. I beg you. Cast off that mask and come back to us, Lord Soju. I told you not to call me that. But you are Lord Soju. Please. I know none of us can claim to understand the pain you have suffered. But at least... At least let me help you bear it. Your hatred, your bitterness, I will carry it all for you. All I ask is that you trust her. Not a day has passed that Lady Sarah has not thought of you. Use your power for her sake. For the sake of your former life. 
I hope I will be with you in the next life. Sarah. Sarah. What is it you want me to do? That was how he got captured. Oh my. You. You killed my mother. So. So that's how you met your end. Now I've become you. I guess now we can switch to the Night Devil. What's that? Okay, Soju. Time I took you to see Sarah. The Abyss beckons. You can do it for doing that. Oh, do we actually see him in here? Do not. Yeah, that's upsetting. Okay, so Zav is the only actual, like, true story summon. Like, the only one who has any tie to anything. And they didn't even bother to keep his story consistent with what happens in the game. Artist, let's spend the sword stones and then that'll be it for this session. Oh, we can upgrade our stuff again. Reach the next uh, thing. Threshold, I guess. Camouflage. Gain more attack the longer you haven't taken damage. Soul Cycle. Chance to instantly kill when attack hits. Only applies when manifested. Reverie. Attacks pierce defense when affinity is over 150. Star Gleam. Chance to negate attacks taken when your affinity is over 150. Meditate. Increase healing the higher your affinity. Always applies when Aisha's in the party. Aisha has ranked up. Swiftness. Increased movement speed. Only applies when manifested. Aspiration. Chance to recover HP when attacks hit. Now we can get one five, so we got all of her three.
Okay, so I think Spring Tide is probably the best five cost one to grab. Spring Tide. Gain more skill power with higher affinity. Just needs 20 more to be tapped out. I guess we'll keep using her for now. Since well, obviously 20 isn't that difficult to come across at this point in the game. And once she's done, we'll move on to Lucica. Between now and then, we'll do another 10 with everybody. And that should make it that we only need like one more, one more session, or like one more mid between session grind. Ah, after next time, it should make it that we only need one more like between session grinding. I'm trying to avoid saying grinding session, <laughs> but I can't think of what else to call it. <laughs> like one more session of grinding in between like next session and I'm guessing the final session because we if there is, if we aren't almost done with the game, then I will be very surprised. Although, actually, let's go to town first. Unless that's where we're supposed to go. Here, let's go back to town. Dang. I wanted to look at what the, again, like what we can upgrade the weapons to right now. Because if, if the highest we can get them to is like 100, then that might mean there's actually still a whole bunch of events left to go through before the game's over. Because we know that we can upgrade to at least 200 because of those lost ones we've encountered. Found these. And all three of these are the upgrade ones. 150 and 200. There's only three after that. So I'm grinding. I'll see if I can find these five. That's going to be it for this session. If you like these, I appreciate doing all the YouTube stuff. Like, comment, subscribe. And until next time, be Victus, Fires and Numeris, and bye.